Hey, uh, what's going on? All right. Um, you know, that last little short message there was just talking about the um, us creating different types of systems that create radiation. One thing you must remember is that when we start talking about radiation, we're not talking about the synthetic radiation like at the hospitals when people go through radiation because there's brothers and sisters who go through radiation when so far so you know when they're supposed to be going through cancer or chemo or whatever and they actually get burnt. You know, their skin actually burns. Alright. Radiation that we're talking about um is dealing with particles and elements that are what you call radioactive. All right, this is what we're talking about. Radioactive material, material that has um, active um, radio frequencies, all right? Active radio frequencies is what we're talking about. So, um, let's just say like, for instance, quartz, highly radioactive. A lot of people don't know that quartz is radioactive, all right? You got smoky quartz. All of your crystals are actually radioactive. Let's just say that. All of your crystals are radioactive. Um, you have uh, your stones, just like we talk about granite, highly radioactive. You know, they have properties of uranium, they have properties of uh, radon in them. They've got uh, properties of uh, uh, thorium in them. So it's, you know, it's, it's, it, because it's in the ground, you know, because it's in the ground, even the dirt itself is radioactive. We're talking about a radioactive planet. All right. Some active radio frequencies. We're talking about uh, radioactive. Uh, quartz crystal as well as granite emits a type of radiance and radiance is, is uh, an energy all right and, 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 it, and the more you have the more energy it expels all right so something for you to actually to, 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 to consider in this type of information where we are gaining more knowledge of self concerning who we are as the original beings all right now as you get deeper into understanding that radiation literally increases the energy within us you will begin to understand on a higher level that this is a type of energy that allows us to expand on a molecular basis okay this allows us to expand on a molecular basis which means when you're talking about molecular you're talking about the molecules within us begin to expand all right and this is something that the societal structure would not promote as far as us as the original beings, they would never promote this right here. You know, they you know they would say, hey, go and, you know, come get this free weed. You know, let's get high. Here's some women you can have sex with. Here's some men you can have sex with. You know, all this, this, this craziness that they provide. But what we're looking at is a type of energy that literally excites what's on the inside of us. All right. It's a type of energy. We talk about radiation, you know, so you can go into a room full of quartz crystals and all of a sudden you'll feel like this sensation of things crawling all over you. And this is this is because the, the, the radioactive energy in quartz is pairing up with the energy in you 
causing you to become more radioactive. Now, when you understand when you become ra more radioactive, a radioactive body literally is a body that opens up so many different areas, mentally, physically, spiritually, emotionally, all right? Um, your memories, extremely powerful memories and the dormant energies that are within you, all right? So this is for you to understand what we mean about opening up gates of radiation within you so that you will become more powerful within your self. You must remember, brothers and sisters, what's inside of us is so powerful. We have plasma, we have uranium, you have we have plutonium, we have mercury, we have I mean you you name it, you you go on and on and on and on and on. And this is within us. So when you create a radioactive field and you begin to understand how uh, or, or what to do, you will begin to activate your biofield. Now your biofield is and is is like a field of information and energy that feeds a living system. All right. It's a field of information and energy that feeds a living system. Each one of your bodies are living systems. All right. So what happens is the plasma within you becomes more radiant, which means that, you know, as you get into this high radio radioactive area, the plasma within you becomes more radiant. And you become to, I'm sorry, you become, you begin to see things on a different level. You begin to do things on a different level, right? Which is why we had a whole enemy who put us into a sleep state by the help of our ancestors who cut deals with them, all right? And they destroyed everything that we used to on the outside of us that we use to charge up what's on the inside of us. Henceforth, we're beginning to see things on a higher level where we as the original beings are now understanding that we must operate on a completely different um, 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 paradigm than what society is operating with all right so brothers and sisters i encourage you get yourself some quartz get yourself some granite you know you, like i said you can you can go to railroad tracks and get granite stone all right why why do they put granite stones by the railroad you know because that that radiation helps the motion of the trains that's something that we did a long time ago and they adopted that because they didn't understand why we did that but we had the granite stones all around the 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 tracks because the radiation the type of of uh, the type of machinery that we had in the old days needed radiation in order for it to operate so we used the granite stones put granite stones all around the tracks in order for in order to increase the radiation. All right, sorry about that. In order to, we, we did that in order to increase the radiation so that the, 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 because we created, we had trains a long time ago. Before these inorganic beings came to our planet, before these whites came to our planet, we already had trains. We had train tracks. Yes, we did. That's nothing new. Don't have them, you know, thinking that, have them have you thinking that um they created train tracks when they came here we already had train tracks and that's why we had the granite because the type of machinery that we used needed that radiation from the granite 
Granite gives off tons of radiation. Quartz gives off tons of radiation. All these different crystals give off tons of radiation. And those there, there, there are inorganic people who have quartz countertops and marble countertops and granite countertops. And there are cases, because they don't talk about the cases, there are cases where these inorganic people are coming up with radiation poison. And it's coming from these elements because their bodies are not in their, their bodies are not conducive to these type to this type of energy. All right. But they want to have the best of the best of the best on a planet that's not even theirs. All right. With elements and 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 stones that don't even match with their bodies. They've got to have the best of the best of the best because they want to look better than us on our while we're on our planet. All right. So understand that the 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 quartz crystal, the smoky quartz, the amethyst, the uh granite, uh the onyx, the I mean you go on and on with all these different crystals. They have radioactive material in them they're extremely radioactive and this radiation is necessary for our as the original beings for our everyday life which means that we must understand that in order for us to move forward we must go backwards to where our ancestors were you know and go back to where we you know we were collecting crystals and minerals why were we doing that because these inorganic beings are doing this but they don't understand why we did it they're just doing it because we did it why do we do it because we were in create we were increasing radioactive fields we were increased the radiation in the area because we understood that our bodies needed ex some extremely high level radiation in order for it to operate in the optimal level henceforth Black Lightning, henceforth Electro, Spider-Man 2, henceforth um, uh, Hancock. You know, you can go on and on and on. So this is all about increasing your level of radiation. That's why we say, brothers and sisters, you know, that's what I said early on. You know, you, know, you want to fight your enemies? Use this money that you're getting to build weapons to fight against them. Why do you think they're so so scared of the orgon? What's 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 so so what's so scared for about the orgon? You got all these crystals, which are highly radioactive. You got copper, which is highly radioactive. You got zinc, highly radioactive. You got uh fucking silver, highly radioactive. You got all these, but they have they have different um radioactive isotopes about them. And this is where the alchemy comes in because you're taking these two different radioactive isotopes and combining them together and creating an even more powerful radioactive field. All right. Because when you create that orgon, the energy just don't go up. The energy spreads out wide as well. So it's something for you to think about. And, you know, this is why, you know, Dr. Devil Blair talked about it. He said orgon, you know, means original. Yes, we, we create an original energy. It's like we create a, every time we create a, a Oregon, we created, a, we, we, we going retrograde. We, we doing retrograde and it's actually increasing the, the, the energy on the planet. Our awakening is their demise. So you see what I'm saying? So it's important for us to understand the, why we need radiation because radiation literally activates our brain, our heart, our lungs. Hey, hey, hey. All right, so you, you you understand that this is this is why we need to understand why we need the radiation. Because this is this is something that increases. Uh, you got, you got. So when you see these inorganic beings want to put cloud seeding in the sky, whatever, do this whole thing about trying to make clouds in the sky. What are they doing? They're trying to block the radiation. 
And this is the natural radiation. Unlike in the hospitals where you have an unnatural radiation, this is a natural radiation. All right. Natural radiation is, is, is extremely powerful. So they do the sky mostly to protect their people. But then there's a, there's another part where they are literally stopping us from getting that radiation that we need from the sun. So this is why it's important for us to begin to understand why we need to build radioactive facilities for our people to come in and sit down and gain this energy. All right. Like a like a like a power station. We gain this energy, get all the energy that we can get. Then get back out there. All right. Get back out there and so that we can prepare ourselves for war. Radiation is literally what 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 charges up our bodies and this takes us into a whole different concept. And we're not talking about the radiation that, that like I say, we're not talking about the chemotherapy and all that shit where they do in the hospital. We're talking about raw power. We're talking about raw power with crystals, metals. Yes. You know, granite, stone has a frequency of 6,900 hertz. If you can pull up 6,900 hertz, you will, I mean, the, the, the frequency is extremely powerful. So study the frequency of quartz, study the frequency of granite, study the, 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 the frequency of moldavite. I mean, all these different crystals and see what frequencies they create. Now you're getting back into physics, getting back into the part of science where you're dealing with sound, the sound energy. It's extremely important, brothers and sisters, to know why we need the radiation. All right. It opens up everything, it opens up everything about us, our minds, our hearts, our everything, you know, creates uh, it increases the magnetic fields around our heart. All right understand this so just want to share it with you all why we need this is why we need the radiation understand that the quartz crystal the granite creates radiant energy this is an extremely powerful energy that 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 creates that uh, uh when you talk about radiation radiant energy you're talking about um an energy that is extremely powerful that literally excites the body. All right. Radiant. Think about it. All right. Think about it. So I'm going to catch you guys a little bit. This is just, you know, message on why we need radiation. Like I said, it's not the, the other stuff. There's a brother who comes on, chimes in every now and then. He talks about how he's got a pacemaker. And I think he says the pacemaker is made of platinum. And platinum is extremely radioactive. And he talks about how he uh, certain things happen. He can do certain things that other brothers and sisters can't do because he's got that platinum or either titanium or either platinum um, pacemaker in his, in his body. So I'm saying all these all these different metals. It's like we have to get back to these metals. This is what when you go, go when you go into um, Iron Man, and what did he do? He he created this titanium type piece, and he put it on his heart area. Why did he put it on his heart area? Because your heart literally controls the magnetic fields. All right, and when you talk about magnetic fields, you're talking about radioactive. Areas you got tell me talking about eight areas of high levels of radioact radioactive energy. Where did they get that from? They got it from our ancestors. When we created these devices and put it on our chest, strapped it around our chest like a belt. Yeah. Increases radioactive field. So you this is why we need radiation, because this this literally causes us to expand. 
into more powerful beings. All right, brothers, let's do your studies. Let's see what you come up with. All right. You got amethyst, you got smoky quartz, you got quartz, you got um, granite. Something for you to think about. All right. Catch you guys later. All right. Much power to you all.